Hi, my name's Todd, and I'm going to show you a few things you can do with Mediafire. With it, you can do lots of things, like share large files, distribute documents to clients, or back up important data. First, I'll log into my account. Great. Here's the My Files page. It's the main interface for Mediafire. Here, you can do all sorts of things, like create folders, sort files, email files to friends, or share them with others. You can browse through your My Files page just like you would your desktop. It's organized by folders and files inside folders. Let's say I want to upload some pictures. First, I'll go to the picture folder I already created. Now, I'm going to upload pictures from my San Antonio trip, so I'm going to create a new folder. I'm going to name the folder San Antonio Pictures. And great, there it is. And then, to upload the files, I just open the folder on my computer. And drag them onto the current page. My upload is complete, so I can click Return to My Files, and there they are. Easy as that. Now that my images have uploaded, I can view them in a list, or as thumbnails, in the image gallery. In this view, you can click to see a preview on the right side of the page. It makes it very easy to browse through large galleries of photos. Let's switch back to the File Manager view, and I'll show you how to move some files around. First. I'm going to delete a couple of images. Confirm the deletion. Done. Now, let's say my wife wants to see just the pictures from the Nature Preserve. I'm first going to create a subfolder and name it Nature Preserve. Select three files. Now it shows me the three I've selected, and I'll drag them over to the new folder, and drop. Clicking onto the folder takes me into it. And there you go. Inside the folder, I have the pictures I just moved. Now let's say I want to send the pictures to her. I can share them in several different ways, including instant message, email, or I can post them on Facebook or Twitter. In this case, I'm going to email them. So I'll drag the folder onto the email icon and type in her address. Done. Let's take a look at the link I just sent my wife. She loves to download the original pictures, which is simple to do. She selects the images she wants to save and clicks the download button. Easy as that. These are just a few of the things you can do with Mediafire. Sign up today.